America. I learned those are the tactically dynamic magpul change sword stick kendo fighting institution. You guys probably don't recognize me because I'm in a little bit different garb. This is my civilian 4th of July loadout. I'm gonna go ahead and go over that. I got my tactical red hat to support the red and the American flag. I got the white. I got the blue on my shoes, my giant socks. Got the tactical green fanny pack because you always gotta run Ranger Green whenever you need anything. Shout out Carolyn and Gavin, this video is for you, my little cousins, fam. But yeah, without further ado, because it is the 4th of July, because America, we're gonna go ahead and get some shooting in. With me today is none other than a super caliber 30 BBs per second ghost weapon. Just kidding, that guy was crazy. But we are gonna do some shooting with a real steel high capacity magazine. Now, I've been hearing at Milson events, they're saying, oh man, you gotta use mid caps to be able to play. I got some mid caps too, but I don't really believe that. I think, I think high caps. If everybody was given 300 rounds and we were able to have a fight, Operator McLevin would one win all the time. But two, I think it'd be, I think it'd be very fair if uh, real steel rounds, if, if it was in this size and it held 300 rounds, everybody would love that. I mean, it's not really possible with dynamic in space, but maybe someday we'll get in the next dimension. Look how quick you can load that. So we're gonna work on some double and triple tap drills real quick. Just warm her up. I've seen you guys been paying attention to that chicken wing. Look at that, old dynamic. Here we go, we're gonna work some targets the best Operator McLevin way. Listen to all those hits. Going back and using those first tactics too. Look at that C-clamp, you can get your C-clamp, you get your over the way over the clamp. It may block my ACOG sight, but uh, that's not necessary. I can shoot and hit the target regardless, as you just saw by that video right there. It's pretty legit. You can also tell that I like like my, oh, sorry. I can't see real quick. Oh, it's just people walking by. Just kidding, they're not actually walking by, but I want to show you how legit this loadout is. Look at that. Dang, let's get another look at the fanny pack real quick. You can see how operator and dynamic, no one in the crowd would know who I am. Just, they'd be like, oh, that's just some random old man with a giant beard who just, who just chilling out there. Well, it's not a random man with a giant beard. It's Operator McLovin. He's gonna work these triple taps like he's never been working before. It's all about trigger response. You don't have trigger response, you're not doing it right. See? Guns can't even work for me. I break them too easy. Look at that. Gotta switch to full auto. Dang. Too much, too much trigger spin. I also do need to get a Spectre BTC MOSFET though. Alright, next part of my gear loadout. We got my handheld flag, so just in case I put that one down or something, I have my little, my backup flag because everybody needs a backup flag. Oh, also when they uh, they created uh, fanny packs, they didn't realize that you're supposed to store not one, but two pistols in here. Also, because of that. Look at this. It's like Nike designed double pistols to be fed in there. Oh yeah, put Glock 18, C, Tokyo Murray FN57. They will fit perfectly. Guess what? Not only that, but I got mag changes too. Oh, dynamic. Hold on, I gotta change the zipper. Oh, this is this is more uh, tactical concealment. Oh, what's going on? What are you reaching down there for? Oh, just, just scratching. Get a little closer to see that. Doesn't even look like I have a gun. What are you carrying? Oh, nothing. I just got a deformation on my chest. It's a, it's a syndrome. Whack, whack. magazine just kidding but yeah guys this has been your uh, tactical operator way of how to blend in oh, excuse me my beard's falling off how to actually blend in on your fourth of july have a great fourth of july I look forward to some really crazy video where i bring a bring out my 10 foot friend 
who, uh, who will be the newest addition to Operator McLovin's crew. I think you guys will love him. It's actually me in my ultimate form, but, but without further ado, I love you guys. You're the best. You're the reason why Operator McLovin needs to slay all the grannies in the world, because you never know if they're going to put raisins in your cookies. Never know. Never know. America.